Hi, this is Delicious. Welcome to the review of Polish vintage rations. Uh, we have two here and uh, this is very hard to get any vintage Polish rations. This is with best before date 2004 and the other one is 10 years younger and the best before date is 2014. This uh, We will start with the newer one. So this is a uh, Russian type S. Um, produced by Arpol and uh, this is just only without entrees which are heated, so just some cans. We have uh, as usual no peelable seal, so we have to use the knife. So the package is quite the same foil as the modern one, or just, just for 2016. We have the special crackers, which we well know from the other Polish Russians. We have uh, 100 gram cans and what's inside? Oh, it's nothing written, just some codes. Okay, uh, we will just taste it. Another can, also 100 grams. This is to 2015, so a little bit younger. We have the pull rings, we have the uh, tea, lemon tea instant drink, this is also in the present versions, uh, knife and fork and some other accessories. So another pack of crackers, uh, uh, strawberry jam. and the content list or information sheet. Uh, what do we have here? All right, we have the content of the cans, which is Tyrolean meat, so kind of spam and uh, poultry pate. And we have the accessory pack. It is just packed in a foil. You cannot open this without a knife. Just a pack of sugar and two packs of instant coffee. Mm, a wet nap and uh, this is a garbage bag. We have a stripe of chewing gum and two candies, so Dicky, vitamin C and coffee, which we all know. And we have matches, which are not present in the newest rations. And we have toilet paper or napkin. So this is the content of 2014 S ration. We have here two cans with meat and pate. We have uh, two packs of crackers, jam, uh, coffee, uh, lemon tea. We have sugar and candies and some accessories. Now this is 2004, this is much more interesting. This is also S Russian, but this is another menu, this is S5. We have also to use the knife to open. Mm -hmm. And we have also a can, uh, also no name nothing written we have condensed milk sweetened uh, sugar another sugar uh, this is instant tea another can mystery can pack of crackers, which are basically the same crackers, just another label, another pack of crackers, and some accessories, and that's all. And we have also to open this with a, with a knife, so this is a tradition. 
Wow, another pack of sugar. Hmm, surprise. What is here? Uh, we have here a chewing gum for children. Um, fruit candy. Two packs of instant coffee. Matches, slightly different. And toilet paper, some napkin, garbage bag. So we have the two Russians here together. So on the right side is the older one, on the left side uh, is the new one. Let's compare this. We have here sugar, but we have three packs of sugar, so 30 grams. And in the new ones, we have only 10 grams. We have here two cans and two cans in the new, so it's the same. Uh, we have matches, but different matches in the two rations. We have here instant tea with lemon and here instant tea. Two packs of coffee, two packs of coffee. More or less the same. And we have two packs of crackers and two packs of crackers. And we have also uh, here we have a gum and uh, two candies, a gum and one candy, so no coffee candy in the old ones. And we have here sweetened milk and we have here a jam, marmalade. So quite comparable. And we have in the newer one accessory pack, so fork and, and knife. Well, uh, let's start tasting with the new one. Uh, these are the special crackers which we know from other Polish Russians. I suppose they are quite good. Uh, so, quite hard, smells good. Uh, it's just normal crackers. So, two years more doesn't make a difference. Now, the cans. Um, look, these new, new cans are from aluminium, these are from steel, so the new ones are just lighter. So there is a progress here. Okay, this is 2014, and this means it's uh, poultry pate. Mm, looks like pate. It smells, mm, I don't know, not that good. It's very soft, as you can see, almost half liquid. And mm, the taste is not so good. Um, I can taste the aging maybe a little bit more with a cracker. Let's taste. It's not awful, it's not bitter or something, but it's not normal, so I, I will not eat it. Rather not. Uh, so two years after expiry date, I would say for this, no. And this is uh, a spam or this kind of pork meat. And this is newer one. And looks good and smells just normal, like this Tyrolean can. And you can see the chunks of pork. And it's it, the taste is good. It's just normal. I would eat it. So the pate is not is not that durable. Now the jam, strawberry jam. This is the same company. All right, it's a little bit, uh, you know, not in the best shape, but inside it's okay. It's a little bit uh, stiff, so kind of jelly, not so runny, but I suppose it will be tasty. Okay, let's taste. Yeah, yeah, it's, it's just, the taste is normal. It's okay, I would say. All right, now the 
uh, older the special crackers from the older Russian. They are a little bit lighter um, and not so hard. And the taste has changed, so I can taste the aging. Um, it's not so pleasant. It's not good. Now uh, you can see the the lids are. Uh, very bad for the older Russians. The new ones are with the silicone and are really efficient. But we have the pull rings. So it looks uh, from the color like something like poultry spam. Now let's taste it. And the smell is not so good. And the taste is really strange. I cannot tell you what it is, but no, um, I will not eat it. So I'm afraid about my health. Another can. This is much darker. I think this will be a pate with liver and it's softer. Mm, yeah, it smells like liver, but yeah, but not so good. And that, yeah, look, the taste is uh, also not so bad as the poultry can, but no, no, it's it's not good anymore. Now the condensed milk, sweetened. We have to punch the tube. Oops. I can see something is wrong here. So the color is not normal. It should be much lighter. It shouldn't be brown. The, the smell is okay. But the color is, uh, you can see, uh, well, it stays normal, but not good anymore. Okay, now the coffees. Let's taste it. This coffee should be actually, uh, there are two packs for 250 milliliters. I will give it uh, to 150 milliliters of water and together with some sugar. Now the older coffee with uh, some old tray, mm, funny. But the explanation is here. It is a bag used in the trains bars, and it was primarily used for fruit juice, for lemon juice. So this is kind of recycling. I cannot open this bag. I have to use a knife. It's not only paper, it's some foil. And you can see the color is different. And so let's take some of the sugar. You can see that the same amount of sugar is packed in a bigger bag. And it is made not only from paper, that, like this new one. You can see inside there is uh, aluminum foil and foil, so it's much more tight. Okay, now let's have some boiling water to this. So the cups are the same volume. Let's give it a stir. This one is much lighter, maybe you can see, and this one is darker, definitely darker. Let's have a sip. Yeah, it's just normal instant coffee, maybe a little bit too much water. And what about this? This coffee is probably mixed with some uh, 
not natural coffee but made from chicory so this is kind of a mixture not just normal standard coffee mm, I, I don't like it that much now we have the teas the old tea is just normal standard black tea with maltodextrin and the new one and this is for 500 milliliters so I will give uh, half of this and the new one is uh, new one is tea with lemon let's have a look kind of granules as uh, and you can see that the, these granules are already old so something has happened to this and this is the lemon instant drink lemon tea instant drink let's say so we have here tea extract sugar um, lemon acid and so on a lot of ingredients this is kind of beverage not the tea let's give half of this because this is also for one half of liter and a little bit of sugar to the black tea now the hot water and a little stir This is much lighter because it contains uh, lemon juice or lemon. Then it's quite good, uh, just like normal this from the new rations. And the old one, much darker. Well, it's quite like uh, just tea from the back. It's okay, but not very tasty. Now it's time to taste the sweets. We have the vitamin C um, candy from the Neuro Russian, which we uh, all know. Which is dicky, which is probably raspberry flavor, a little bit sticky. But the taste is quite normal, so it's okay after two years. Now let's take the older one. Uh, which is fruit candy and the shape reminds me of some candies which were made uh, which were made 40 years ago but this is quite good it's it's softer than the new one you can chew it it's tasty no signs of aging I'm very surprised thumbs up now maybe let's taste the coffee looks quite good and taste it normal just like normal coffee it's safe to eat it now now we have the chewing gums um, the first one is the new one planet it's a mint chewing gum a stripe uh, you can meet the stripe gum also in uh, this Polish firefighters rations. Mm. Ah, it's totally uh, dry, so it's it crushes. You cannot chew it. It's it's out of order, I would say. No. And now this. Um, Yes, you can you, you can probably recognize uh, the Smurfer, which, which was the just cartoon for children, and it's soft, but it's it's quite soft, and you can chew it. It's fruit gum, so the taste is quite nice, I would say. 
and it is made in Poland by uh, famous Odra in Brzeg. Not very perfect, but quite okay. But we have something here. What could it be? Mm. Was this a story? No, it's a part of puzzle. What a great idea to give the the soldiers puzzles to to cut out and to play. All right, this was the review of Polish vintage Russians 2004 and 2014. Uh, thank you for watching. Uh, subscribe my channel. Give me thumbs up or thumbs thumbs down. And see you in the next reviews.